On October 10th, Elon Musk will reveal the new Tesla Cybercab. I have come across leaked information which reveals why Elon delayed the reveal date a couple months. He wanted to deliver food, luggage, and people. The original Cybercab was only meant to deliver people, but the new Cybercab can deliver food, luggage, and people. I invite you to think about it in terms of first principles engineering. It wouldn't make much sense to shuttle people from the suburbs to work downtown and then have the car sit downtown doing nothing until it picks up workers downtown to shuttle them back home eight hours later. The cybercab should be doing work during the workday. It could deliver food, legal documents, and other packages downtown during the day with the help of the Optimus humanoid robot. For more complex deliveries, such as to a tall office building, the cybercab would text the recipient upstairs to come down and get the package. The recipient would then either come himself or call the doorman downstairs to receive the package for him. There would be several lockable compartments in the rear of the cybercab. A cybercab detects the recipient's phone nearby. A compartment would automatically unlock, allowing the recipient to get his package. If the recipient sent a doorman to fetch his package, then the doorman would need to punch a three-digit code into a keypad on the side of a Tesla cybercab to unlock the compartment holding his employee's package. For simpler deliveries such as to residential simple single-family home, cybercab would stop at the address of the recipient. Then Optimus would get out of the delivery car and get the package from one of the many small rear lockable compartments. Then, Optimus would carry the package to the front door, call, and text the recipient. Finally, Optimus would then drop off the package at the front door, return to the cybercab, and then leave. Having multiple lockable delivery compartments would allow Optimus to use artificial intelligence to figure out the most efficient route to deliver multiple packages and people. For example, instead of wasting electricity and time going to restaurant one, customer one, restaurant two, then customer two, Cybercab could pick up the food from restaurant one and then restaurant two if the two restaurants are next to each other. Then if customer two is on the way to customer one, AI could then dis decide to drop off the food at customer two first, then to customer one, even though customer one ordered food first because Cybercab would drive by customer two on the way to customer one. On October 10th, Elon is going to show off a Cybercab delivering a pizza using Optimus. Optimus is a humanoid, but not a human, so it can fold itself into a small package in the trunk of Cybercab so that it wouldn't have to take up a seat that is meant for a paying human passenger. Optimus will unfold itself in the trunk jump out of Cybercab, pick up a pizza from a restaurant and carry it back to the Cybercab, which will then deliver the pizza to a recipient. Optimus will then carry the pizza to the front door of the recipient. Optimus delivering a pizza is the extra thing that Elon wanted to show off on October 10th. They will try to do this with a trained end-to-end -end neural network, but if they are not able to do this on time, then Optimus will be remote control to do this. If they do this, Elon would honestly tell you that it is remote controlled, but promise that it will be done by an end-to-end -end neural network in the future. I am so excited. I absolutely cannot wait to see this on October 10th.